What's up guys, welcome back to Nomad Walkthroughs. This is going to be episode number 3. We're going to be showing you guys the tower, radio towers. So you can look and see where they're at. And we're also going to be working at the uh, unmarked construction sites, the burger place, and the military base. And to show you guys what's inside them. Um, I'm going to go here and test him to the... Uh, Medical Hospital, place. yeah, medical place. It's a pretty recognizable building. They all look the same. They're in every town Tustin, Glendale, or Pinewood. I believe they're they always in color. Yep, they're red, and they always have a white fence around them, like the police station, which we'll get to later. More like a metal fence around it. They all have a red cross sign out in front of them like that. Sometimes the stuff be back there like that. There's mud pack. Morphine injector can break fixed legs and any doubt. Sometimes they'll show up on these shelves on the back wall. Yep. Go through here and there'll be stuff on the Beds, I guess. Or what are these things are called? The hospital gurney. There we go, gurneys. Painkillers. I found a few med packs. Yeah. Now uh, let's show them the radio tower over here. The painkillers can make medical packs. One paint car with two bandages will make a med pack. Furniture, we don't have the recipe, so we can't make our own med packs right now. Okay, we're going to go up to the radio tower now. And come right up to here. It's not going to be so dark time we get up there. See this, guys? You can see all. Pinewood area, all the way to the beach. I mean, there's the military zone, military base, actually, it's called. I mean, it's pretty good distance. This is the Glendale area, towards the Glendale, south end of the map. Uh, the cheeseburgers right over there, area. There's that mark, which was in sight. But yeah, this is the, the view. You can see the bridge we crossed. Being up here is uh, good for snipers. Good for people who just want to get oriented and find out where they are on the map. If you press M, you can get to your map if we haven't mentioned that yet. And on the map, it will show you where you are by the uh, white pointer. That's your 
that's you. And what which way is pointing, that's your direction that you're facing. See, if I face this way, now I'm facing towards Pinewood. There you go. I'm going to stop it here for now. Mm -hmm. the construction zone at night? Yeah. Or do you want to go? Let's show the const mark construction zone. Do you have a torch? No, I do not. Alright. I can make one. I don't want to get water here. Yeah, There's a squash. Okay. Holy crap. And sometimes the game glitches and it will make you jump up in the air. <laughs> There's nothing up here. Might find something in the on my construction site here. Yeah. Here, I got it. I had a pair of boots. First uh, thing to point out about the construction zones and most other buildings like this, they are building denied, so you cannot build in them. So own like so that other players can get in there, so you can't take over an area like this. Oh, final present. Lucky. Got a pick and a piece of metal. The wood. Torch. What are you doing here? Guys, most time I scrap things because they don't really need them. Yes, and I know that darn helicopter is so well. Damn, the helicopter so well. Sometimes you can look around. You find another building, something like this. Uh, these would be pickaxes or axes, uh, yeah. something like that. You would pick up. There. They'd normally be on like this box right here. here. This would be or up on here. Room. Or now we'll be the room, yep. Like that. Damn, you found two of them in here? Yes, I did. <laughs> You never know what yeah, you can find in here. Yeah, you can find guns like the shotgun or a nail gun in here. I found a block 19 just now. Wow. Now uh, let's go to the search drop. Yeah. You keep getting lucky, they keep dropping right by us. Zombie. Kill the zombie, kill the zombie, what the heck, you threw me in the air. Okay, wow. that happened.
That was mostly recipes. An explosive recipe? Cool, now I got mine. I know the explosive recipe with the heck. It's probably because it kicked me out of my- No, it was full of recipes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 762. Um, barbed wire barricade. That's another uh, defensive barrier. And traps. Um, we already got the explosives. We're gonna sell that to the uh, trader for a thousand dollars. That really is. Uh, right. Sometimes oh. when you shoot zombies, you'll get this raw zombie meat. It's green, so looks like a zombie. And if you eat the meat when it's raw, it will well infect you. You get sick. So you have to cook it. But now we're gonna go to the uh, burger house. I'm gonna try to avoid them as much as possible. Again, there's just so many zombies here. And here is the food market. Yes, it's normal to have zombies in here now. Um, you just gotta be super quick. Or have a gun. Or have a gun. <clears throat> For a second person, because the zombies like to follow the first person they see. Yeah, yep. That's all the zombies. Jeez. That was a lot. <laughs> I know. I wonder if any of them dropped any ammo. Uh, it doesn't look like it. Did you have to kill any big ones? No. Yeah, sometimes the big ones will drop ammo. Just never know what type. Usually 9mm. Maybe five by not not five by ten. Twenty five ACP. Yeah. See, this is what they'll be sitting on. Ooh, Gizmo. You can find picks here. Sadly, there just wasn't one. Yeah, they spawn in different stuff. Kind of potato. <laughs> They're following you now. Bring it, big guy. Aha. Oh, 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 
I'm dead. Oh crap. Run. He's too strong for me. Yeah. I'm quitting again. Here. Take it. Should we go to the military zone? Yes, we should. Since we gave him such a great example, is why you should just run from the zombies. <laughs> Yeah. Okay guys, we're at the military base. See if we're right out of like few military. I uh, never know what you can find here. You can find night vision, all your guns, and ammo. Just do not know. There's a zombie. Coming right behind you, he's a runner. There we go. Another try. Oh, five point five six. Canteen, like the best water source to carry around. Gives you two drinks for one fill up. Ow. I'm gonna run up in this tower. Fast zombie. Fast zombie. I was gonna pick up a present. Oh, I found body armor. Lucky you. I'm about to jump down on the zombie, smack it in the head. Did it. Wow. I literally landed on top of its head, looked down, and smacked its head. There's a sleeping body by the medical tent. Really? Yeah, but I'm going for it. <clears throat> I'll look to see what's on it, but I'm being chased by a lot. Uh, there's a minigun on the body, and a lot of good stuff. I'm gonna put some zombie meat on their body to be sure. Oh, crap. Oh, Let me get the body armor and helmet. Thank you.
Oh my goodness, he's got uh, 338. <laughs> I have Oops. Thor. I get the bolt. Okay, I grabbed it. Wait, does he have yes, he's got pants. He's got pants. <laughs> Can I By the way, this is a hot spot for player versus player activity. So you will run into other players here a lot. Do you want to be top of your uh, chair and very vocative when you come to this place? There's nothing in these tents. Got body armor and stuff, but I don't really need it. Bandage. I gotta drop some first. Bandage. I'll eat this. I'm gonna get a rocket. Oh, cool. <laughs> You want to show them the buildings over here they can find a pick in? Yeah, near the military base would be some similar bases to the construction site. It'd just be on the right hand side of the military base as you're looking on the map. Uh, nothing in this building. Who are present? Uh, look out! Kill the ones that are after me. Man, those zombies. Yeah. Alright, uh, we're just gonna go on home to our base. Drop this stuff off. Yeah, you just never know what you expect at the military base. Sometimes you find great loot, and sometimes you just end up 
that someone's there or anything or just not good at all. Just bad ammo types to your own Vikings and yeah, just chunk. I'm gonna build a small one by one. What, right next to the military base? Maybe. I'm stuffed. I see you. I'm too stuffed to really do anything to it. Yeah, I just run at home. Back to the base, I'm gonna put some stuff upstairs. I'm gonna use this boot present so we get a magnum and two ammo boxes for the magnum. Green present, ooh, K78-4 and two boxes, 7.62 millimeter. Another green present, uh, chunky pocket pistol and 225 ACP. Scrap the 25 ACP ammo. Yeah. That will try to give you a uh, gunpowder GP. And you can scrap the metal. Metal. You can scrap the 44 GP. Yeah, uh, nothing. Nothing. Oh well. Food do you need? I'm good for now. Alright, then I'm gonna eat this deer meat because I am almost dead. <laughs> well, I'm not almost dead, but almost out of food. Oh, guys, we can make a C4. I can show you guys yeah. how to make it. You gotta have five metal pieces and four four gunpowder um, to get explosives two metal four gunpowder that will look like this um, then C4 is three metal and one explosive and there you go there's your one C4 time the explosive so we
Oh wow, med things to make a med pack. Yeah. Ooh, heavy axe. Yes. Uh, ammo. Stand away. Stand back. Oh, he's got a pick in here. He got oh, watch out. I want to. I want to shoot those. Look out. Alright. This one's full of metal. This one's full of metal. It has six metal. Those are some weird names. Look at the names. Oh, that's full of metal. Put. Yeah. Oh, here. It's in the. It's in the box. Wait, you're not gonna break this down? Oh, well, I could have done that, but... Oh, so they got... Oh, helmet. I had a... Ooh. Armor. I had a big backpack. <laughs> I'll take those things. Here, take the good, uh... Heck yes! Did you feel guilty? Damn, I was going to take those pants for a while. <laughs> what do you mean every time you speak? Take like my rip one. Shotgun with ammo. That's the other shotgun too. Yeah, he also has the bolt. Yeah. This is me, this is the guy who owns the territory. One of them, yeah. Oh, guys, uh. Oh, never mind. Never mind. Oh yeah, it's out of ring there. Yeah, this is why you upgrade your doors to metal. Yep. Because I put my name on their workbench and now I can walk through their house. Um, guys, going to end it up on that. Uh, done a lot here. Um, thanks for watching and click that subscribe button and give it a like and also hit that bell button too. Gives you notifications on what video I'm going to be coming out with on next. And thanks for watching, big tanks.